A lot of people don't like the 1998 Godzilla movie. I mean, a lot of people. And that's okay. I'm not here to defend or slander the film, but I do want to bring up one thing, and that's that the promotional campaign for the movie was phenomenal. I've been putting up some segments and infomercials for Godzilla merch from the sci-fi channel that aired leading up to Godzilla's 1998 Memorial Day release, but there's so many much better promotional material for it. Not including that music video from Puff Daddy, he did he did he. Anyways, here are my top five. Godzilla Online. I've never actually played the game or seen video footage, but it seems a lot more thought out than the other tie-ins that didn't make the list. Like the Strike Zone and Smash 3 games we got to coincide with the 2014 outing. Godzilla Online boasted 3D graphics with several playable classes as well as an array of different game modes, not to mention it could be a baby Godzilla. The teaser. The full teaser shows a group of kids with a boring tour guide in a history museum looking at a full T-Rex skeleton. The build-up is a bit drawn out, but the cinematography, sound effects, and acting are fine. Soon, Godzilla's foot stomps down through both the ceiling and the T-Rex before moving on. Some say this is a stab at Jurassic Park, but it is what it is. Our first glimpse at the new design, albeit just the foot. It's something new and different at the very least. We get the iconic green glowing 98 font, we get the new roar, which I still say is a perfectly fine one. I can remember going online and watching a shorter, sure to have been quick time movie of this teaser. Solely just the stomp, but then to the title. I'm not even sure there was audio, but I watched it a lot. And as far as the teaser goes, for better or worse, I'm pretty sure it got me more hyped for a movie than I have ever been. Size does matter. Not the slogan itself, but the actual ads, the neon green letters on billboards saying his eye is as big as the sign, ads on benches, encompassing the entire length of a bus. They were everywhere, pushing what was supposed to be a huge hit and promising a titular character of monstrous proportions. In my opinion, he wasn't that big, but whoever thought up slapping size does matter for an ad campaign was brilliant. Ice cream. That's right, from May 20th through August 1998, Eddie's ice cream had a limited edition vanilla flavor to coincide with the film. Did I say Godzilla Vanilla? What I meant to say was Godzilla Vanilla with Chocolate Godzilla Chips and Fudge. Taco Bell. This isn't number one just because I worked at Taco Bell for far too long, but because of the amount of content we got from this partnership. The timeless cup holders, the toys, the boxes, and of course the iconic Hero Lizard Lizard commercial. There is even an accompanying plush doll. What's your favorite kaiju promotional material from the past or present? Let me know in the comments and thanks for watching.